This video is powered by the pros at Pascal Air Plumbing and Electric. Arkansas owned, Arkansas operated. GoPascal.com. And just proved what Coach been preaching. Just work, just hustle, hustle, hustle. And I feel like we did a wonderful job at that. But we still came up short with the turnovers and everything. Yeah. You guys got out on them. I think they were like one of 17. And you guys were up by 10 at one point. Kind of what was the beginning of that game like? Because you guys hadn't led the other two games at all. And then you got off to a good start and obviously kept the crowd in the game, kept yourselves in the game. I feel like, um, you know, we we changed the offense up. You know, we knew where our shots were going to be at. Um, I feel like guys was was comfortable out there and in their position. I feel like, um, you know, we made the right reads in the first half and we got the big lead and just kept on. Our offense was keep on, on pushing us to our defense, and we had the def defense rocking and rolling in the first 10 minutes. That hard, kind of leave it all out there, and, and then but Kentucky's able to to make a run late. Just how disappointing is that? Yeah, it's very disappointing. You know, um, you know, we got to capitalize on every moment. You know, you know, every every possession matters, as, as you see out, out there. Um, I feel like Kentucky is a great team. I feel like we should have won up tonight. Um, you got to take better. Good, Take better uh, care of the ball. Physicality standpoint inside between you and Makai, did y'all talk about in practice or a lead up that y'all might have a, a advantage physically uh, on the front line? Man, coach had a meeting with me. I know um, he said just go out there and rebound with the, and make sure you, you, the bigs. I feel I, I know like the old Miss, we got our rebound. I feel like my job was tonight just to rebound me and Kai, and I feel like we did a great job of just leading the team in rebounds. Follow up on the defensive strategy. This is a high octane offense. Was the plan always to try to grind this down into a low possession, low score game? No, we just want to take every we, coach want to run a play every time. You know, get a right, right, right uh, play set for for a mismatch. You know, I feel like we at the end we got a little carry away with it. I feel like um, we should have kept on running more sets and still iso ball. I feel like, um, but you no, know, we it's a learning it's a learning matter. You know, I feel like we're gonna learn from this. We're gonna grow and we're gonna. Look at the film and practice hard and just get ready for Missouri. At the end that you mentioned, was it anything specifically Kentucky might have changed or just some sloppy play on y'all's part? I mean, we knew they they chopped the ball screen. You know, I feel like he tried to throw it between two guys in the short row. I feel like it been working in the whole game, but it's just that the matter of point. It those guys been they caught on to what L was doing. Second straight game, you guys struggle offensively. I mean, do you feel like it – does it wear on you, like, in the game when the shots aren't falling and it's kind of a – the offense is in the mud a little bit? Or does it not really dawn on you till after the game and everything? I mean, I see in guys' faces, you know, you know when shots not going in, they it, it reflects on their defense. I feel like we got to just keep on pushing when we miss shots. You know, you're not, you're not going to always have a great offense tonight, but your defense is going to always win games. Defense right there, you said earlier, it was rocking and rolling early. Just was there anything y'all were doing differently defensively to kind of slow them down? I mean, we was just playing together, you know, just talking to one another, you know, just having each other back, you know, contesting at the rim, no free layups, and probably no open threes, you know. They, they didn't really have too many threes in the beginning. I feel like they got too many in the second half. Or one and six in SEC play, but the way y'all played tonight, was is this something you can maybe build on? Do you think is, is the morale? I mean, obviously you don't like to lose, but it, it – I guess the lot yet they haven't lost the locker room. I, I guess like have you, are y'all still kind of fighting, and you think it'd be something you could build on? Uh, of course, we can we can build on this. Uh, I know we, we don't want to celebrate no more victories. I feel like um, we should have won. I, I know um, we won in in, in the rebounding and hustle. You know that's the that's the every we've been like look, look lost at. I feel like we get our get our chemistry back, and I feel like we gaining our trust with each other. Yeah, I think Kentucky, they, like I said, they really struggled early one of 17 but then late they were hitting threes i mean just what would you think of that i guess you just have to give them credit because they're obviously a great team uh, i feel like you know this, they just kept on running their sex and i feel like uh we just gotta just pay more attention to details to the more of the shoes and get out there and make them drive and put on the floor more i feel like we we lost lost details to the shooters hey, that's his best game in a while what, what you think of makai's game how good was it after mom back uh i'm you know, Kai. You know, he been he been having some, you know, some some frustration with himself. I know. I, um, he he proud of himself tonight. You know, he got a double double. You know, coach been on us about rebound. I feel like Kai main focus out there go to rebound and let the offense game come to him.
just wondering how this one feels in the locker room compared to maybe, and I like earlier this week where you're not really in it in the fourth quarter, emotionally in the locker room, how much different is that? Man, you know, a loss is a loss, you know, but we we got something to, to cheer about because we, we didn't lose in like every every era tonight in every category, you know, as rebounding and, and the hustle points. I feel like it's a lot to learn still, you know, we still learning what we need to do best for the team and we're gonna get we're gonna get this thing back rolling. But you felt like late y'all should have stuck with maybe more sets instead of going ISO ball. Was that something that just kind of happened in the flow of the game or was that something being called from the sideline or, or what happened there? It's you just think? something in the flow of the game. You know, guys feel like they they can take their man. I feel like we just gotta pay attention to much more and read, go off of him. And I feel like guys just got, you know, just in the floor of the game, you really know no play call on the sideline. It's just on us on the, on the floor. Bet Online is your number one source for all your betting needs. Get the latest odds, lines, and matchup reports for baseball, boxing, golf, and more. Bet Online continues to be the fastest and easiest way to place your wagers, including live betting and your favorite casino and card games available to play right from your phone. Head to the website or use your mobile device to sign up today and get in on the action. Remember to use our promo code BELIEVE. That's B L E A V. For your 50% welcome bonus on your first deposit. Bet online where the game starts.